The SJB 2004 Revocable Trust, Part 5, Where Are the Funds? We have seen in previous videos that when the conservatorship was established in 2008, Brittany ceased to act as trustee of the SJB Trust, and Brian and Ivan were named successor co-trustees. But the question remains, where are the assets? When they were appointed, it was explicitly mentioned that the place of administration of the trust is Los Angeles, California, and the assets cannot be moved out of California. According to Meaner, Brian threatened to sue the conservatorship of the estate in March 2010, but was allegedly persuaded to resign voluntarily in April 2010. So that left Ivan Tabak as sole trustee of the SJB Trust. On September 10, 2010, Ivan was authorized by the court to delegate the investment powers to professional managers and Robin Krasny and Mark Lewis, who worked at UBS at the time. These investment managers were authorized to invest the SJB assets and the assets of the conservatorship in separate accounts, but as a unified whole, according to an investment plan. In January 2011, Robin and Mark moved from UBS to Morgan Stanley, so Ivan requested to move the SJB assets from UBS to Morgan Stanley so they could be managed by the same investment managers. They were allowed to work together with Ivan, James Wallet, and their agents in relation to the investment strategy. In July 2013, the investment strategy was modified. In August 2013, that order regarding the investment strategy was corrected to state the new allocation ranges for the SJB Trust. For fixed income from 50 to 90% to 40 to 70%, for equities from 5 to 35% to 15 to 40%, and for alternatives, including without limitation rates, from 0 to 20% to 0 to 30%, which increase the investment plan's risk. Also, Morgan Stanley and Merle Lynch appear as acting on behalf of Ivan and therefore the SJB Trust. Side note, the judge granting this order was not Rivad Goats, but Judge Roy L. Paul. There were no other known transfers after that so the funds should still be mainly managed by Robin and Mark. They both created the KL Wealth Management Group, now the Altera Wealth Management Group at Morgan Stanley, where presumably most of the assets of the SJB Trust still are. This is consistent with the accounting of the conservatorship of the estate which shows that most investment assets are held with Merle Lynch and Morgan Stanley. It also matches in GAM's statement from the November 20, 2020 hearing, where he indicated that there are two outside investment managers. Given this long-standing structure with the same investment managers for almost a decade, raises the question as to why Ivan abruptly resigned, Jamie Lynn was named his successor and tried to move all the SJB funds to Stonebridge. We'll explore that in the next videos. Stay tuned. <laughs>